Hello, welcome to the seven day reset. I am your coach, Nicole, and I am here to guide you through this reset for the next seven days. So first thing you want to do, pick your start date. Um, I did mention in the reset, there were a few supplements and protein powders. You can get those on ishopperium.com and use my gift card code give love that's all one word to save fifty dollars off of your order if you already have a probiotic a protein powder that's plant-based and some barley greens that you enjoy using go ahead and just use what you have if you don't i highly recommend you order your stuff through purium because they are the purest and some of the most tastiest so Order your supplements, make sure they're here before you start, pick your start date, and then the next step would be to get all of the groceries that you need um, from your shopping list the day before you start. And then you're going to want to make your rice um, probably the day before you start, or you could make it on the day of if you have time, and chop some vegetables. So this is a super easy plant-based reset, and you will be eating the same things for the seven days, so be sure to change up the herbs and spices and the flavors and make it how you like it so you don't get bored of something. And also, if there is a fruit or a vegetable that you don't like, just substitute one that you do like, just as simple as that. Keep it super simple on yourself. And um, I'm so proud of you for taking this next step and taking a vacation from processed foods and giving your body a reset that it needs to heal and repair. And also, did you know that this can actually be, actually be kind of a spiritual experience as well? So when we're feeling all these cravings and, you know, we're used to doing the same things day in and day out, um, it can be, you know, really hard to listen to our intuition or to get in tune with our spiritual side. But when we're doing a reset and we're cleansing our body and removing toxins and we're not doing our regular routine, we are actually more able to get in touch with that intuition side, um, our spiritual side, if you will, whatever that looks like for you, whether it's God or the universe or a higher power, um, Either way, it'll it'll all work out for you to be able to get in more in tune with your spiritual side. So that's also very exciting. And as a free bonus, I want to invite you guys to schedule your free health history consultation with me so I can give you some personalized recommendations going forward in for you to be able to sustain a more plant-based lifestyle. So all you have to do is text... 503-449-9804 and just say I would love to schedule my free health history consult and we will get that going guys. We can meet in person or online no matter where you are. So again my phone number is 503-449-9804. Reach out to me and let's get you scheduled for your free consult. That's just my bonus to you so that you can sustain a more plant-based lifestyle going forward and you can continue to put good things in your body. And everybody is different. We all have different things going on. So I like to give personalized recommendations um, for everyone. So with all that being said, again, I'm super glad that you're here and um, I'm super excited for you to go on this journey and give your body a break from processed food. Now in the recipes, I want to mention, it says like for the breakfast smoothie, two to four bananas. Well, if you're a woman, you'll probably want to have two bananas. If you're a man, you'll probably want to have four bananas. Also though, some women are very active and they might want four bananas in their smoothie. Completely use your own discretion on that. Fruit, like all we're eating is the fruits and veggies and the whole plant-based alive foods. So if you had four bananas, it's not a big deal because you're going to need to get your calories from somewhere. So if you're really active, you could choose to have four bananas. If you're a male, you could choose to have four bananas in your smoothie. If you're not that active and you're a smaller person and you're a female, you might only want two bananas in there. So just use that as a guideline. Eat until you're full. 
Um, you know, start with one cup of rice. If you feel like you need more, have more by all means. Um, and just eat until you're full and then stop eating. And another tip I want to add is that sometimes we feel hungry in between meals when we're actually really thirsty. So if you're feeling hungry after breakfast, lunch, or dinner, before going for a snack, I would like you to try drinking another cup of water or a cup of herbal tea or both before you have your snack. That way you can actually tell if you're you were actually hungry or not and by drinking the water and the tea that's going to help your body know if you're actually hungry or not because if the hunger feeling goes away after drinking you know you were actually just dehydrated and you were thirsty so those are my tips for you please reach out for your free bonus and get your health consult scheduled with me and please also text me if you have any questions at all because I want to support you on this journey. I want to help you on this journey and I want you to succeed. I'm here for you guys. All right. Congratulations. I'm so excited for you. And don't forget to join the Facebook group. The link is in the reset guide. All right. That's it for now. Bye guys.